I was a big fan of Batgirl as a kid, that's a girl, I saw her age stuff as well. And we came up to a convention, hadn't started at the cosplay, and saw the people dressed up, and I thought, what an excellent idea to be able to wander around legitimately in Lycra during the day, and it went from there. I sewed my first cape, which was this one, and Paul Hero Wears made my cowl, and it all kind of, and it just built up and progressed, upgrading each time, you know, you find bits on eBay, and then you try and make something yourself, and then you mould something, so it just progressed until it became something which was all in its entirety, a lot more polished. Most of it, some of it, and Paul from Hero Wears as well. For example, I, I do a lot of the sewing, so I sewed all the bits and the cape, Paul made the cows and the armour bits and the fins. The corset with was came up from the state, so a custom person, again, Greg Mario made this, so um, yeah, it's a little bit of both. The week running up to a convention, it can be solidly all day for a couple of days, depending on if you're going to do a new costume or not. But yeah, it, it does take, you know, for example, making a cake takes about five hours. So yeah, it can be quite time consuming. If you... Life for Catwoman is on the cards, and that's the next one for LFCC. So it's, it, like, this is the Pfeiffer course, it's very, very close. But yeah, it, and luckily Paul's got an original, um, a moulding of the original Pfeiffer cow as well, so it really, it's going to be very screen accurate as well, we're going to try and get it spot on.